Hello citizens, welcome back to another video guide and tutorial. So, CIG decided to put Gasping Weevil X, one of the most valuable drugs in Star Citizen, into the bunker gameplay. By now most of you already know that I always welcome and support any type of additional gameplay that we may have while playing any of current gameplay loops in Star Citizen. In this video, I will show you which mission you need to unlock and play to be able to find Gasping Weevil X and boost your profit greatly. Let's jump straight to the gameplay. First, I recommend you to take a ship with a good firepower since you will need to take out the laser turrets around the bunkers so that you can park your ship as close as possible. Another way of course is to use a ground vehicle like Drake Mule, Cyclone or Ursa Rover so you don't need to bother with laser turrets. I like to do it in this way and I will show you why. Now let's talk about the mission you need to unlock and play. It is of course destroy illegal drugs mission which you can find in mercenary tab once you unlock level 2 with crusader security. Today I am using my beloved Drake Corsair which is fully upgraded with military A components and I like to use full ballistic repeater setup for this mission. Once you destroy all the turrets, park your ship as close as you can and then enter the bunker. Regarding your personal equipment, make sure to have a lot of ammunition so that you can destroy all the drug boxes except ones you want to take with you. I'm using my Demeco LMG, which now have increased rate of fire so it is even more powerful than before. You can use FS9, but it is nerfed a lot with reducing the ammo count from 120 to only 75. It is still amazing gun, but for this mission I still prefer Demeco. Once you get inside of the bunker, kill all the guards and start to search for Weevil Eggs boxes. This server is not the fastest one so NPCs are a bit slow in their response time. I also like to take the boss to my ship and take his armor and gear. Let's kill the rest of the guards and then I will start to transfer Weevil eggs and maze boxes towards the exit or main elevator. Everything is clear for now, so let's start to search for Weevil X boxes. I am destroying all these boxes because this is where I will transfer the valuable drugs from upper floor later. By the way, this mission is bugged, so you can't see the number of drug boxes that you need to destroy, so best way is to destroy everything after you take the valuable boxes. Keep in mind that guards will spawn eventually, so pay close attention to your surroundings. When you kill enough guards, you will need to take out the elite guards too. It has heavy armor and uh, have a backpack on his back. It is a bit harder to kill, but not too hard. Time to reload and equip more ammo to my belt and this is why it's important to take enough ammo for this mission. You will kill a lot of guards which is also a good way to loot and take additional guns and armors. I like to search and take all drug boxes from this floor and after that I will go up and then search and take all the drugs from upper floor. I will show you how you can do that in a really fast way. I suggest that you also take maze boxes, since that is the second most paying drug in Star Citizen.
Okay, now I'm gonna transfer all these Weevil eggs to the main elevator. And this is why we need to be able to place these small drug boxes inside of the new one or two SCU cargo containers, since it would be way easier to transfer everything from the bunker all the way up to the ship. Let's hope that CAG is watching this and will make possible to place small boxes inside of the big containers that we now have in Star Citizen. And just like I said, this is the elite guard, make sure to take his armor and guns after you kill him. Now I will transfer all to the elevator and with the power of editing this will look like this. All these Weevil X boxes are only from the main floor. Now it's time to go to a second floor, clear all enemies and again search for Weevil X and maze boxes. Here is another elite guard. So, after I killed all the guards, I started to transfer all of Evil Eggs and Maze to this specific place. From here, you need to transfer them all to the floor below us. And if you place them all here, then it will be easier to transfer them to the main elevator. Let's speed this up. Let's go to the lower floor and uh, kill all the guards and make sure that everything is clear before we start to move boxes to the main elevator. So this is the place where we moved our boxes from upper floor. Now just like the first time you need to move them all to the elevator. I will skip this part and just show you how much boxes I managed to pick up from both floors in this bunker. And as you can see, there is a lot of them. I believe this could be around 400,000 credits for a mission which pays 55,000 if you destroy all the drugs. So, these 400,000 is a nice bonus. Good job, CAG. This is the way I want to play Star Citizen. You can simply take the mission, destroy all the drugs, take 55,000 and some loot, or I can decide to make extra money and take these high value boxes with me. Now, what I did next, I just moved all the boxes outside and then I parked my ship like this so that I can easily transfer them to a cargo hold of my Corsair here. You can try to use a Cyclone and transfer your boxes in that way. Don't forget a Drake Mule 
which can hold up to 8 boxes. So in case you decide to park your ship away from the bunker to avoid turret fire, just use one of these ground vehicles to move your boxes to your ship. With all the boxes inside my ship, I have jumped to Brio Breakers Yard to try to sell them. A quick question for you. What do you think about adding Gasping Weevil legs to the bunker missions? Will you try to earn money in this way and do you think that we should be able to place drug boxes inside of new SCU openable containers? Ok, unfortunately Maze is only thing I was able to sell, so I jumped to Hurston Scrapyard to sell my Weevil legs. This time I was successful. After this hard working day and decent profit that I've made today, it's time to celebrate with a good sip of whiskey. Cheers! Fellow citizens, I hope this discovery of Vivolex in bunkers is useful to you. And if it is, please consider to like this video, share and subscribe. Don't forget to leave some comments because I always love to hear your thoughts. Thank you for watching and all your support, it means a lot to me. Stay safe in the verse and like always, May the force be with you all.